Hi, in this video we're going to show you the new Windows Spotlight desktop background feature for Windows 11. So when you turn on your computer, or log off, lock it, that kind of thing, you notice you have these spot, Windows Spotlight images here, and sometimes they'll have little icons you could click on to see more information about the pictures. And we actually have a video showing you how to find and save these pictures if you want to use them for other things. But now Windows is going to let you use these for a desktop thing or theme or background images as well. So we're going to show you how to do that. So first we're going to log in here. Okay, so what you do is you go to your normal method, right-click on the desktop, personalize. You could also get there from settings. And now you have this window spotlight rotating background images theme you could do. And you could also find it under background. And if you choose window spotlight from there as well, so either way, I'll take you there. So when you click on that, now you see we have the window spotlight images. And you have this little guy here, learn about this picture. And if you right click on it, you click on open, and then it'll kind of take you to that picture there. And then you click on all if you want to find information about it or more images or videos, that kind of thing. And now see how it rotated by itself. And sometimes you could hover over with your mouse and it'll give you information. And then you could also, you know, rate this picture if you want and switch to the next one. You know, it'll do it on its own automatically, but you could do it manually if you want to bypass one. So there's maybe four or five pictures here, or if it does it in random order. So this is a new feature. Uh, this is in the Windows uh, Insider Preview uh, program right here on this computer, so that's why it has it. So your computer may or may not have this yet, depending on when you're watching it. And then I assume these will probably change uh, like it does for the uh, Windows Spotlight images over time. You know, I'm imagining they're not going to leave you the same pictures forever, so that'll be left to be seen, I suppose. But anyways, just, you know, like I said, go to your personalized options and then pick it from the theme or pick it from the background. You could pick one of these and you know, if you don't want to use the regular pictures or one of your own pictures, you could pick the window spotlight. And then you'll have this, and you could uh, find out information about the pictures if you like it, and take it from there. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.